Hey, Native Son, come on in. Thank you so much for inviting us in. We have 20 questions that will help us get to know you better. Think of it as a first date. I love dates, especially first dates. <laughs> okay, awesome. Let's just jump right into it. How do you start your day? Well, I start my day with prayer, meditation, but I have to be caffeinated. Coffee or tea? Coffee. How do you like your coffee? Uh, I like my coffee black with a touch of cream. Well, you may like coffee, but I know you got some hot tea. Oh, definitely have some hot tea. Um, one time I crashed a party for Beyonce in Times Square, and I was so nervous because I thought I would get in trouble with Yvette Noel Shore, and I'm on the dance floor getting my life, and I turn around, and I'm dancing with Beyonce, and she's like, I'm so glad you joined us, and I'm so glad you're here. That was amazing. Hot tea. <laughs> Indeed. Your apartment is pretty fabulous. Did you use a designer, or did you do it yourself? DIY, for sure. This is black gay man, how I live. Amazing. Have you ever considered a career in interior design? Uh, haven't considered a career, but I do write for Architectural Digest, and I actually wrote Shonda Rhimes' cover story. You have a lot of books. Clearly, you like to read. Well, in the words of the legendary Dorian Corey, reading is fundamental, darling. What's your favorite book? My favorite book? Notes of a Native Son. I'm guessing the author is your favorite author? I love and adore James Baldwin. What inspires you about James Baldwin? I love that James Baldwin was light years ahead of himself and he was an activist, an author, and he talked that talk and his words still resonate for future generations. Well, the way that you've been inspired by James Baldwin, your career has definitely inspired others. What advice do you have for the up and coming legendary children? Oh, for the legendary children? Be fierce, be fabulous, be authentic, know your history, and do your thing. Are you a butch queen? Aren't we all? Top or bottom? I mean, depends on the day. Mask or femme? Um, I'm in my soft era right now. <laughs> well, it seems you have some news to announce for us today. Yeah, so excited. We're announcing Native Sun's digital platform on Queerity. And so we're going live. And what should we expect with this new Native Sun content on Queerity? Well, Black gay men are not a monolith. So all of our stories um, are going to be there every single day. Content, content, content. And you're launching on Friday, August 2nd, 2024. Why? Because it's my favorite author, James Baldwin's 100th birthday. What keeps you up at night? Uh, the 2024 election keeps me up all night. Everybody registered a vote. What gives you black boy joy? Um, doing this work, like I really am inspired by amplifying the voice and visibility of black gay and queer men globally. Last question. Are you your ancestors wildest dream? I'm going to let you answer that question. <laughs> all right. Well, Thanks so much for having us, Emil, and have a great day. Have a great day, and thank you, Native Son.